Hey guys, Chris Friend here from Jensen USA. I'm here with Nate from Specialized, and today we're gonna to talk a little bit about tires. Yeah, thanks Chris, glad you're here. Um, so today we're gonna to talk a little bit about, uh, mostly mountain, um, we're gonna talk about uh, treads, we're gonna talk about casings, and we're gonna talk about compounds. Yeah. And I didn't know this, but like, tires are a big part of Specialized history. Huge part of Specialized History. So uh, Specialized with, with being in business over 40 years, uh, tires, believe it or not, were the first product that we brought to market. So we're super passionate about tires. We invest a lot of time and energy on tires. We've been chasing um, the best performing tires, uh, road race, mountain race for all of that history. Can you tell me a little bit about what kind of compounds that Specialized uses and what kind of casings? Yeah, absolutely. So um, at Specialized, starting with the compound, the first thing you have to know is Gripton. So Gripton is our um, proprietary patented compound technology, and you're going to find it on all of our tires. So mountain and road all have some element of Gripton in it. And what Gripton is, is like I said, a special formula um, that we can um, manipulate um, dampening, uh, rebound, um, grip, and rolling resistance. Um, and we can tune that to the application of the tire, again, mountain or road. So when you're in a situation where you need a fast rolling tire, we're using a certain compound that is gripped in. When you need something that's gonna hook up in rough conditions, we're using a, a stickier gripped in compound with more of an emphasis um, on grip. So the other really cool thing about Gripton though is it does both things uh, better than any other compound on the market. So when you have rolling resistance and you have grip, usually those things are kind of at odds with one another, right? But with Gripton, um, the rolling resistance at low frequencies, so when you're just riding along and you need speed, um, the tire doesn't slow you down. But when you do dig in and you're going over rough terrain, what Gripton does on the grip side is, it, is it's able to pick up the higher frequencies better so your tire's not bouncing around, um, it's not interfered with the rolling resistance when you're going fast, but when you do need it to dig in, it's rebounding appropriately and staying sticky on the trail. So tire manufacturers usually always have like a million different casings and they all sound really good. Can you break down the different casings that Specialized uses and kind of explain which one will be best for certain riding situations? Yeah, absolutely. So on the mountain side right now, um, we have five casings and it covers everything from race, uh, World Championship XC, all the way to gravity downhill. So starting on uh, the race XC side, um, we have the S-Works casing, so that's your super light, um, that's your no compromise, fastest tire out there when you're, you're trying to win and you know, super minimal weight. Um, the next up from there is your control casing. So control casing is a little bit more protection, kind of all around our XC, um, still a race tire, but something that you can, you can ride all day and have a little bit more confidence, a little bit more protection um, on the sidewall. Up from there, our all around trail tire. So we're stepping up in strength, um, sidewall protection. You're getting a little bit beefier treads in this casing. Um, so all around trail tire called the grid. And then up from there, a brand new casing that we'll get into a little bit more detail on is Grid Trail. So that's Grid Extra. So aggressive uh, trail, um, a little bit more sidewall protection, um, better, uh, better quarter, cornering under, under lower pressure. Um, up from there, we go to the, the beefiest tread that we make, or the casing that we make right now, and that's Black Diamond. And that is completely bomb proof, um, gravity applications, when you're shuttling or maybe you're riding a, a Turbo Levo, that's uh, something that can, that can handle the weight, handle all the punishment you're gonna throw out. We wanted to delve a little deeper into two of them today um, because they're brand new for this year. Um, number one is on the control casing. Uh, we upgraded that with a little bit more sidewall protection. So we added um, a flip up casing on the side. So you're gonna get a little more support, uh, a little more protection. Um, you know, both from pinch flats at lower pressure uh, and also a little bit more uh, control under, uh, under braking on low pressure. Um, and then on the grid trail, that casing is entirely new, built from the ground up. So like I said, it's an evolution of the grid. It's kind of in between Black Diamond and the grid, uh, the grid casing for kind of that sweet spot. And we think that riders, um, you know, ourselves included, are gonna be really happy with this casing as the all-arounder, um, as we're getting more aggressive, on trail bikes, we're, we're doing park days. Um, you know, we're, we're asking a little bit more from our tires. You know, we need something that's gonna, gonna work well under low pressure, um, gonna work well on e-bikes. 
um, you know, really going to um, perform all day long, but still be peddleable uh, as opposed to something with, you know, a really beefy overbuilt casing. I imagine all these casings are tubeless ready, right? Absolutely, yeah. Every, ca every casing that we make is, uh, is a tubeless ready. Cool. So Nate, we talked about casings, we talked about compounds. Can you talk to us a little bit about the different tread patterns you guys hear at Specialized for your mountain bikes? Yeah, so absolutely. Um, so yeah, uh, over the five uh, casings, um, we have about eight tr different treads in the line. Um, so on the cross country side, um, S works in control casings, you're gonna see uh, classic all arounders like um, ground control, uh, you're going to see Renegade, you're going to see Fast Track, which are our super fast rolling race tires. Um, you know, basically minimal tread, uh, hard pack oriented. And then as you go up from there, you're going to get into uh, Grid Trail. And that one, um, you're going to find the Purgatory. And the Purgatory is uh, really our all around trail tire, does anything really well. Um, and then up from there, when you get into Grid Trail, uh, you're going Eliminator, Butcher, Slaughter, and Hillbilly. Um, and those ones, again, aggressive conditions. Um, Hillbilly's built for, for mud over rough stuff. Uh, Slaughter's a pretty, pretty classic. Um, fast rolling in the mid middle, but with uh, great uh, shoulder knobs for cornering. Um, Butcher's a pretty classic control tire, so we recommend that one as a front. Um, Eliminator and Slaughter are uh, really great rear tires uh, to pair with that Butcher in the front. Yeah. And now where we're from in Southern California, it's hard pack, really steep, pretty rocky. What would you recommend for our terrain? So for you guys, if we talk casing, you know, grid trail is really the way to go um, on those sharp, sharp rocks. And I would say um, eliminator um, with that, uh, that butcher in the front is the way to go. Well, thanks Nate for sharing us a little bit about tires. If you guys have any more questions about specialized tires or tires in general and which one's best for you, feel free to reach out to one of our gear advisors. Thanks for watching. Nate, thanks for having us and keep pedaling.